Oh, yes, Greg. Oh, my God. Cleaned it up. Oh, man. I just dug a target. I thought it was junk. And I'm like, wait a minute. The, the relics I'm finding are amazing. This, these relics are insane. Greg's got his dais. I got, I got mine. He just got a buff. Got Pat's got his Equinox. There's Pat. All right, let's see what I we can get. Something. There's my machine. Man, this thing is crazy. Absolutely crazy. It's a lot to learn, though. I'm trying to figure out, like, the deep targets, you know, when I, I'm not sure, like, what they, you know, are supposed to sound like yet. Huh? Greg, guess what? Jefferson. <laughs> Turned out to be a weedy in there too. Really? So yeah, that explains it because I'm trying to get used to these signals. But you know, it did tell me there was something somewhat deep in it amidst a bunch of garbage. Uh, Greg just pulled one of these. There's going to be a ton of these here. We hope anyway. Yeah. Oh man, it is kind of wow. Well damaged Indian. There's something else in there? Nah, it's just a uh, little mineralization. Yeah, I can't get a date yet, but you can see her right there. Cool. All right, second coin here for me. I'm trying to get used to this machine. I don't know, you know, like I do on the Knox, what it should be. You know, like it, the way it rang. Oh, I can't even tell. Wow. This one's chunky. This could be an actual Indian. Uh, I cleaned it up enough. 1893. Just what you'd expect right, here. Real close to that other one. Man, this machine separates incredibly. I've been here hundred times i hate to say it but i've been here a hundred times me and emma with the knots it's nuts this is right in that same air. that other indian was right there with the um uh the weedy i think and another i could actually tell you could see it almost the headdress right away on this one but this was another one yeah you can see it in the back let me All clean right, it i up. think i see 1897 maybe yeah, it's beat up i thought it was a lot nicer than it actually was but still Two Indians, right in like two foot square. Just came yeah. over. There's his shoes, our sneakers. Yeah. <laughs> um, trying to break off. The I just pulled joke. another one. Oh, that's a '65. Pack got one too. Trying to break off some of the junk by the date. Any luck with any date? Uh, I think 1898. All right. Oh, that one's nice. Oh yeah, a little chunky in the middle. 98. Cool. Put this on, but Pat wanted me to listen to a, a target right against the root. It was a whole bunch of junk. Two pull tabs intertwined, another pull, pull tab. And then one of those little uh, bag tie things. So all uh, around, right, all together. Yeah. And that's pretty cool. Only penny in the I mean, it's just a weedy, but it is, you know, sitting there amongst all that other stuff. All Incredible. Yep. Oh, yes, Greg. Oh, my God. You mind if I grab it? Yeah, yeah. Still on it? It's great. Nice. Oh, my God. It's beautiful. Oh, my God. Oh, dude. Class ring. Slamming class ring. Oh, no way, really? Oh, my God. It's beautiful. 1974. I always have singles, but I can never get gold rings. Cleaned it up. Oh, man. Aren't you glad we came? Yeah. Oh, my God. I had that's what I was Beauty gold, gold ring. 10K. All right, we're going to see if there's anything inside of it. Wow. Deus is on the gold. Wow, just a, amazing, Greg's gold ring. I'll tell you, the machine is incredible. I just dug a target, I thought it was junk. And I'm like, wait a minute, that is not junk. Look at this thing, is this the tiniest crotal bell you've ever seen? Oh, is this a tiny button? I mean, it's brass, it's beautiful. I can see some decorations in it, I don't know. I gotta look at this. Wow, look at that. Take care Great. of the sun. 
I think it's easier to see like this. Wow, look at that. Got a little cross there, a little cross on that side. I don't know if that's an actual cross, but that's the design. I tried to clean it out. This looks like the tiniest bell quarter bell I've ever seen. <laughs> this is like a minus 10. I don't know. Wow. Back of a cuff link. I am sniffing out, by the way, areas that I know I pounded with the knocks. I mean, I am finding that I just found that little bell this so far. Give me a little time. Let's see what part happens. of a heart pendant, I guess. I don't know about how old, but it looks like a copper jacket and maybe some crap inside metal. I just cool. ran into Greg. Wow. He got this to go with the gold. Dude, look at that. Pretty oh man, weird. that is so cool. Especially that the eyes are filled in. Yeah. Like a bird skull, like some kind of, I don't know, weird. I forget what that's from. Now yeah, you guys will know. I'm thinking my key, you know, I'm going through some uh, adjustments here with this machine. Patches came over with his stuff. Oh, cool. And then I found that Indian before I see as that. well. We got a Merc, the yep. Indian. What year is that Merc? 1939. Yep, 39 Merc. And this beauty. Oh, my God, I love that. Look at that stone. It's in good shape. So cool. God, we find so many earrings of this design, you know? Mm -hmm. Like a like Georgian or Art Deco. I don't know. Probably Art Deco. So nice. I just found another Indian. See it right there? And I'm going to clean this up. You can see that green underneath. Give me a minute. It is 1893. Alright, I hope to be this is a good spot. Flat button. It was only like two inches down. I don't know. That's so weird. I mean, it's alongside of a tree, but crazy. Uh, the, the relics I'm finding are amazing today. Look at this one. This is like a Civil War soldier. Looks like a Union soldier in his blues with his cap there. Wow. This was in this, right next to the flat button. God, these were relics. Look at this. These relics are insane. This is a lead toy here. Like, look, I could see the horse. I could see the, t obviously his head's gone. Wow. That's amazing though. Beautiful. Showing Pat the uh, toys I found. The soldiers. He's got a, I just got a rosy and an 09. Weedy. Weedy. You can see the 09. Can't tell if it's a Can't VDP tell, yeah. Try cleaning it. It's gonna be take a while to figure that one out. All right, we might be going. Just show me this. I didn't record it, but I think it's cool. Very cool. Look at that. Gold plated gold silver. Gold plated silver. Yeah, 925. What's that name on there, Greg? Weird. Satya. Trademark Satya. Pretty cool, eh? Yeah, it is. It's, it's really cool. Solid chunk of silver, gold plated. Hey, folks. Nice. All right, here's that wrap up. You know, remember, I was uh, still in training. I was in Deus 2 training. <laughs> um, that's no excuse. I just, I'm trying to figure this machine out. It, was, it wasn't that easy, but you know, transitioning over. I'm still working on it. But um, yeah, I mean, look, four Indians, which, you know, is a good day. Any way you look at it, one of them being in a 65. Pretty cool. Um, we got uh, one flat button, which is crazy. This I actually found, I'm just putting it here because it was on a previous hunt. I was with Greg and I forgot to show it. It's just a, uh, like a small pocket watch, I believe. Then we have uh, this pretty cool little soldier. Uh, obviously, I think he's missing both of his hands, both of his legs, just about like he was in battle. <laughs> I hate to laugh, but a lot of the guys ended up like this. You know, you get hit with a cannonball. So yeah, pretty cool, that little uh, toy. And then this beauty, unreal. I mean, this is a big, heavy piece of lead. 
another nice toy. Missing his head, missing the legs. Could have been hit by a plow, who knows, a lawnmower. But, uh, and then this really cool piece. I cleaned it out. Uh, the dinger is in there, but it's stuck to the side right about here. You can, oh, let me see if I can zoom in. Yeah, I tried to clean it. I was hoping it would have did a little jingle, but no, it's still in there and it's stuck. But yeah, it's really cool. I mean, this is probably, you know, from a pet, you know, a dog or a cat. I'm, I'm guessing a dog, but uh, who knows? Could have been a cat. Really tiny piece, I mean, but I could see this hanging around a, uh, you know, a dog or a cat, maybe a little ring, you know, letting you know that it's around. But yeah, that was it. Obviously, Greg and Pat did much better. Um, Greg has uh, become, you know, acclimated to that machine. He uh, He's pretty good with it. And Pat, you know, Pat's very good with his knock, so. But yeah, his... Uh, Here's some picks. Um, I'll show Greg's and Pat's picks also. So, thanks for coming.